you know, we know that creation's eagerly awaiting that type of stewardship, really. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's awaiting that proper stewardship again, the stewardship that effortlessly expands, that isn't yoked by idolatry, but instead actually right. produces the fruit of the kingdom and liberty, right? Mm -hmm. And But I felt like Holy Spirit highlighted something to me that I don't know how, it's one of those times you're like, how did I never see this before? A few verses before that, and I think this is so key to stewardship, a few verses before that, it says this, for as many as are led by the spirit of God, these are the sons of God. Uh -huh. You did not receive the spirit of bondage again to fear, but you received the spirit of adoption by whom we cry out, Abba, Father. Right. And I felt like the Lord was showing me this because I was driving to church and he said, instead of judging culture, adopt it. And I think that the starting point for some of the stewardship of territory that we need to see is actually through the spirit of adoption. And I want to bring that up right now because knowing that we've been adopted by God is so key to then functioning with God's heart as a steward, where we adopt that which is perhaps broken, that which is perhaps cast off, that which is perhaps lost, that which perhaps is struggling, and we adopt it. And, and Jesus said to Jerusalem, Jerusalem, like his heart for a territory, how often I wanted to come and gather you up yep. how often yep. i wanted to come and adopt you and i that heart would come upon us lord and it would start by actually us as sons realizing just how adopted we are and just how much the lord stewards us